chapter number six. So practice set six point three part two. That is simplify. Okay, the first sum. It is x plus y the whole cube minus x minus y the whole cube. The formula that we are going to use here is a cube minus b cube is equal to a minus b a square plus a b plus b square. We have used this formula for part 1 also. Now our a is this and this is our b. Okay. Come on. Now let's substitute. So instead of a minus b I am going to put this as a and this as b. So x plus y minus so I'll put the box, put a box bracket here, a. For a, I put x plus y minus b. For b, it is x minus y. Done. Now the second bracket, this box bracket is over. It's completed. So now second one, a square. a square means x plus y the whole square plus a into b means x plus y into x minus y. x plus y into x minus y okay plus b square means plus what is that b x minus y x minus y the whole square the bracket closes so we have just done the substitution now let's solve okay here now when we open the bracket this is minus sign so the signs in the second bracket are going to change so we will have we will take x plus y as it is since it's the first bracket now here it is minus and once we open the bracket this is plus so plus is going to be minus x now it's plus x so when you open the bracket it will be minus x now plus y is going to be, oh, sorry minus y is going to be plus y i have changed the signs why have i changed because of the minus sign over here now the second bracket x plus y the whole square remember the formula of a plus b the whole square what is the formula a square plus 2ab plus b square so this formula we are going to use here so x plus y the whole square is going to be x square plus 2xy plus y square okay that formula is done now plus x plus y x minus y you remember there was another formula a plus b a minus b is equal to a square minus b square so this formula we are using here. So x plus y, x minus y is going to be x square minus y square. That is x square minus y square. Understood? We are using this formula. A plus b, a minus b is a square minus b square. So x plus y, x minus y is going to be x square minus y square. Now this plus sign plus. Now the, the other bracket, x minus y the whole square. So for that we have to use a minus b the whole square formula that is a square minus 2ab plus b square okay so this formula we are going to use for this bracket so it's going to be x square minus 2xy plus y square okay bracket closes i hope this is clear now come on let's solve it out now here plus x and minus x gets cancelled so one y here and one y here so one y plus one y gives you two y okay so this bracket is done now here we'll open the bracket x square plus two x y plus y square plus x square minus y square i'm just opening and writing it plus x square minus 2xy plus y square. Alright, I have done nothing. I am just open the bracket and I have written it down. So now let's see what can get cancelled. You know, same terms with opposite signs we can cancel. Plus x plus x cannot get cancelled. Plus 2xy minus 2xy can get cancelled. So plus 2xy minus 2xy gets cancelled. Plus y square minus y square gets cancelled. What remains? 1x square, then this is the other x square, then this is the third x square. 
So 1 plus 1 plus 1 is equal to 3x square and 1y square remains. So your, your final thing is going to be 3x square. Why 3? 1 year, 1 year and 1 year gives 3 plus y square. Now here what we have to do is we can multiply this 2y with the whole thing over here. The whole bracket. So 3 2s are 6 x square y plus 2 y cube. Why 6? 3 2s are 6. Y into x square is x square y or y x square plus 2 into 1 over here is 2. Y into y square is y cube. Now let's do sum number 2. Sum number 2 is 3a plus 5b the whole cube minus 3a minus 5b the whole cube. Again the same formula a cube minus b cube is equal to a minus b a square plus ab plus b square. Okay. This whole thing is our a and this whole thing is a b. Come on let's substitute. So is equal to a minus b that means 3a plus 5b minus 3a minus 5b. Okay. Next bracket. a square. a square means 3a plus 5b the whole square plus ab means plus 3a plus 5b. Multiply by 3a minus 5b. This 5b plus b square. b square means 3a minus 5b the whole square. Done? Hope this much is clear. Now, uh, let's open the bracket over here. I'll start from this end so that it becomes easier since the sum is big. Okay. 3a plus 5b. This is plus. Here this minus sign. So, I have to change the sign of the numbers in the bracket. So, plus 3a is going to be minus 3a. Minus 5b will be plus 5b. Okay. Done. Now, second bracket. 3a plus 5b the whole square. Now, same thing. a plus b the whole square. So, what is the formula for a plus b the whole square? a square plus 2ab plus b square. Okay. So, now a square means a square means 3a square plus 2ab plus b square. Done. Now, again, 3a plus 5b into 3ab, 3a minus 5b. The same formula, a plus b, a minus b. What is the formula? a square minus b square. So, 3a square plus 3a square minus 5b square. Now, a minus b the whole square formula is this plus sign I will write here. a square minus 2a b plus b square. Okay. Now, we have done the substitution. Now, let's solve. Okay. Here, we have plus 3a and minus 3a. So, it gets cancelled. 5 plus 5 is 10 b. Okay. Now, the bracket. 3a square means 9a square because square of 3 is 9. Now, 3 2s are 6 and 6 5s are 30. So, plus 30 a b. Plus square of 5, 25. Square of b, b square. Plus square of 3, 9. Square of a, a square. Minus square of 5, 25. Square of b, b square. Okay. Plus square of 3, 9. Square of a, a square. Minus 3, 2s are 6, 6, 5s are 30. So, 30 a, b. Plus 25b square. Solving part is done. Now the cancellation part. Let's see whatever 
you know wherever there are same terms with opposite signs we can cancel so here you have 9a 9a plus plus we cannot cancel plus 30 minus 30 so plus 30 minus 30 you can cancel so your plus 25b square minus 25b square can be cancelled now what remains 10b comes down as it is you are inside you have 9a square plus 9a square plus 9a square and plus 25b square okay so you have 10b 9 plus 9 is 18, 18 plus 9 is 27, 27 a square plus 25 b square. Try this with this. So what we will do is 10 into 27 is 2, 270 a square b plus 10 into 25 is 250 b cube okay so 270 a square b plus 250 b cube is your answer sum number three is a plus b the whole cube minus a cube minus b cube okay here a plus b the whole cube formula we we'll use you remember what is a cube a plus b the whole, whole cube formula it is a cube plus 3 a square b a plus b the whole cube formula is a cube plus 3a square b plus 3ab square plus b cube. So this formula we are going to use for this. Okay. Because since there are three terms having cubes. So we will use this formula for the first term. So what we will do is substitute. So here we get same thing a cube plus 3a square b plus 3ab square plus b cube minus a cube minus b cube we'll take it as it is minus a cube minus b cube now let's see what all we can cancel plus a cube and minus a cube plus b cube minus b cube gets cancelled so what remains 3 a square b plus 3 a b square that's your answer now sum number 4 is p cube minus p plus 1 the whole cube. Now here we will use a cube minus b cube formula that is a minus b a square plus a b plus b square. Okay so this is our a and this is our b. Let's substitute a minus b means p minus p plus 1. Okay, we close here. A square means P square plus A into B means P into P plus 1 plus P plus 1 the whole square. Here we open the bracket, uh, we will open this bracket. So we get P, this is plus P gets converted into minus P plus 1 gets converted into minus 1. Okay, now. Here, p square, 1 into p is, p into p is p square, 1 into p is 1p plus a plus b the whole cube formula. So, a cube, sorry, a plus b, a plus b the whole square. So, a square plus 2ab plus b square. So, here, plus p minus p gets cancelled so what remains is minus 1 here p square plus p square plus 1p plus p square plus 2p plus 1 now can we cancel anything no all are positive we can't cancel anything so minus 1 remains out 1 2 and 3 p squares we have so we get 3 p square 1p plus 2p is 3p plus 1. Okay. Now, this minus 1 gets multiplied with the whole cube. So, you get minus 1 into 3p square is minus 3p square. Minus into plus is minus 3p. 
minus into plus is minus 1. Okay. So, you have 3p square minus 3p minus 1 as your answer.